Hello, this is part two to a knife made out of a file video. If you didn't see the first one where I actually make this knife, check that out too. Now in this video, we're gonna heat treat this blade and we're gonna make a Kydex sheath with a pocket clip. All right, we're back in the shop and we're back on this knife made out of a file. Now, you guys sent me down a rabbit hole in the comments Man, why can't anything just be simple? A bunch of people suggested that I should heat treat or at least temper this blade. There is a fantastic video that I found on YouTube all about heat treating. It's an old school video. You can tell it was recorded on a VHS. Awesome. Linked in the description. Basically, you heat the metal up to various temperatures and you treat it different ways. Like you let it cool slowly in the air or you quench it in water, you quench it in oil. Um, and then after you quench it in oil, it's really hard, but then that means it's brittle so the so the tip can just like snap off or actually the whole thing can just crack in half and you don't want that. So then you temper it, which is you like put it in like 400 degrees or 500 degrees and you let it sit there for like an hour and then you let it cool slowly and then you do it again and there's just all this crap that I didn't want to get involved with because I wanted this to be a simple project where I'm just a dude in a garage with an old file and an angle grinder and I just made myself a knife, right? Can things be that simple? You know, I don't know. Maybe it could be that simple, but... Whoa. <laughs> Can you see how smoky it is in here right now? Oh, I gotta open a window. All right, here we are. We picked up this black color and a little bit of scale. I gotta finish cleaning that off, but I'll prove it. It's hardened now. Okay. File skates on it just fine. So this is, this is hard as a coffin nail right now. All right, I got the oven preheated to 450 degrees Fahrenheit. Let's put this in. I'm gonna let it sit in there for an hour. It's a small knife. I think an hour is gonna be fine. One hour later. All right, time's up. I'm gonna pull this out of here and take a look at the blade. Gotta pay attention to the color. God dang it. I think I might've screwed it up. I think I let it get too hot. All right, I brought it over here by the window so you can see. You see that blue purple? along the edge we really only want to be seeing that gold color yep damn it got too hot we gotta we gotta heat treat it again all right going back in the oven this time i've got a piece of steel on there my thought is maybe when the elements are turning on and off the radiant heat is heating up that edge too much there's there's too much heat getting to the getting to the edge so i've got a 3 8 inch thick piece of steel in there that this is going to be sitting on that's going to hopefully guard guard that from happening again. Here we go. Maybe I'll put tin foil on top too. Does the top burner come on when you're baking? I don't know. I also have the heat turned down a little bit, down to 375, so I'm going to try and creep up on the color that I want. Hopefully we don't blow past it again this time. One hour later. Ooh, look at that. Oh, that's nice. Gotta put it in again. One hour. Time's up, here we go. All right, it's a new day. We got the knife, got some amenities strapped on, got some tape over the blade to protect it. It's time to make a Kydex sheath. I've got, I've got the Kydex warming up on top of my little fireplace here. I've got a big hunk of steel, some old chunks of yoga mat, we're just gonna make this work. Now, I've never done this before, so I'm sure it's gonna work perfect. All right, it's 
cooled down. What do you think? Success? Failure? Place your bets in the comments. Well, it doesn't look too bad, huh? All right, here's what we got. That's looking pretty good. Nice. All right, now I want this to go in my pocket, so we're going to make a little pocket clip right here. Check that out. Complete with the pocket clip. Now you may remember when I formed this sheath, I left some provisions on the side of the knife here, on the side of the handle, and that's why I would have room for that pocket clip and the little eyelets that hold it in place. So that clears nicely, comes out of there nicely. Man, that's Nice, I am happy with that. Let's let's slip it in my pocket. All right, so here's the real test. It's got to go in my pocket. Now this clips down nice and securely. That's nice. I like that. Now I can just reach in with one hand. Bang! Slip it back in there. I'm loving that. Well, I'm pretty happy with this. The pocket clip works great. The fit is great. Slips in and out of there just right. I love that bronze color on the blade. I'm just going to keep that. Hell yeah. All right, that's it for this video. Thank you for watching. If you liked this video, please hit like. If you want to see more videos like this from me, hit subscribe. If you want to see the video that I mentioned earlier about heat treating, tons of information in there. Definitely check that out. Link is in the description. Also, I'll put the link. It's up, it's up there, one of these corners. Anyways, thanks for watching. I'll catch you on the next one.